I, there's so much to talk. I I want to start with the end because it's might be the first complaint I've had about Ozark in a while. I'm not entirely sure I buy Richard Kill and Frank Jackson. I don't. Yeah. I just hear. Yeah, you don't. All right. Well, it's time for episode 13 of season four of Ozark. Jimmy Macrum, Marcus Cash, SP3. Uh, last we saw, uh, Wendy is. <laughs> it's going around. Wendy was going through it. And she <laughs> sat in her car. Um, she, at first of all, she had a breakdown from her dad. Yes. Who, by the way, not the greatest dad in the world. It, it, no, far from it, quite frankly. He went full of uh, They're going to see you for what you are. It was um, me, Wendy. It was me all along. <laughs> <laughs> they weren't. He did turn into the gra- he had the gravel a little bit right? in his voice as well. Yeah, the kids have awesome. turned against her. That was Everything good. she caught L after L in that episode as well. <laughs> you got you got Schaefer. He's gonna have the 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 tricky uh, bat uh, poles, <laughs> head machines. Oh my God. The, the tonality of his voice, though, very, very much to me felt like he's about to come out with a Wendy screw my knee line. <laughs> um, he, he didn't even need the detective. They did all that work. <laughs> they, they, they used, they used their one good thing for the DNS that they were supposed to use for Navarro on this guy to get his job back, and it didn't even matter. At all. You have shitty kids. You know what? All things considered. Uh, does Wendy deserve all this? Yes. Um, but, only if her dad gets worse. Um, press the little red button. Wow. Is she destroying the trailer home? She is. She building a house there? I approve. I like it. Same. I love it. She said she was gonna turn a new leaf, and it starts right at, right from home. I don't know if we're gonna see inside an apartment or whatever. It's a good work. Oh shit! God damn! All right, who does she blame this on, though? That was Dick with Renegade. Oh, you you telling me she doesn't have a concussion? She might. She probably does. You can be functional with one, right? Yeah, she can. That's to it. Back down the hatches, like of the Ozark. It's about to get wet and wild. I'm Towns of Wells. Keep it locked on the hollow. Towns of Wells. Well, I'm throwing a party on top of a fucking boat, Towns and Wells. <laughs> I don't know what that means. Why don't you talk to the radio? You're not in good shape. <laughs> well, you just said there's going to be a storm and she's doing a boat party. Yeah, that don't add up. I've been there. Hi, I need to check myself in. I am not feeling well. He's out. In your own words, describe your current situation as you see it. Are you just gonna read from that form? Here, just, just, just t- to take this. <laughs> take this. I will pay double. Just, just let me in for, for one night. Have you ever had thoughts of harming yourself? I'm having thoughts of harming you, John. <laughs> Here's a list of therapists in the area. What? Hey! Oh, shit! Oh, oh shit. shit! John! That's a question. John! Who's trying to find his It's just a job. And to be fair, he cares way more than that first girl. That first girl should be shot in the spot. <laughs> she went, ugh. John, did you come handle this, please? Yo, that first girl was over it. I jumped, oh, like. Let me try to imagine what she did on a daily basis. I got my record expunged. Oh, yeah? Mm-hmm. Good for you. Look at that. He's kind of proud. It does seem like you should have seen this coming after Darlene passed. All those shares just floating around. For Aren't you feeling bold? Control and interest here is mine. So you need to find another way to launder your money. Wow. Having a good time? This is dangerous. <laughs> okay. Uh, they're taking your shit to the storage closet upstairs. They're so fucked. These two? so I what they're dealing with. Playing a dangerous game, Roof. Mexican drug cartel, and I don't know. Oh, what the fuck? I can wear a, a, a patch like a fucking pirate. Are you all right? 
Wendy, are you, <laughs> you should take it easy for the next few hours. What do you think? I'm easy. I'm very easy. <laughs> okay. Uh, I will iron things out tomorrow. It's talking on the shit. He's like, are you? <laughs> okay. <laughs> you don't sound okay. Uh, acting before is a lifetime for Wendy, though. <laughs> I don't know. Well, I'm sorry to hear you going through yes, this. Yes, we are all sorry. Marty, I have become officially impatient. Okay. <laughs> uh, I think. That's not gonna be a problem, huh? Marty, please tell me you're not too distracted that that's gonna be a problem. That's not the problem. It's a different problem. What is she doing? Oh, daddy! <laughs> Get in here. Oh, what? Oh, God. Oh. Your house, mm. new car, security, safety. But I'm gonna go ahead and keep the kids. Now you go, or I'll call the police. Oh shit! It took way longer than I thought it would. I thought it was gonna go and take the money. I never cheated on your mother. You did. She forgave you, cause mom was a real Christian. <laughs> you did. I'm not nearly as devout, and I will kill you before I let you take my kids. <gasps> yeah, oh, Wendy, yo. Now you just got her on, what's the, what crime is that when you threaten to kill somebody? I think he's recording. So don't they trust his trunk in court? A ring or shit? <laughs> that probably pissed him off the most. I cleaned my record up, and you and Wendy ain't gonna shit where I ate. How to get both sides? Uh, yeah, I guess. Hey, you gotta hand it to her. She's a fucking little animal. Right? <laughs> Image is everything in that world. She's been acting different. I can't lose it. That shit's great. Wish it was her hands. Well, if you won't do it, I'll do it. What does that mean? What the fuck do you think it means? <laughs> she's in her own world, the way she looks. <laughs> oh my god, she really had a nervous breakdown. I hope she won't leave what she does. I love how she says, congrats. This is great. <laughs> Nasty bitch. I think you have no sense of humor or human fucking decency. I do too have a sense of humor. <laughs> Yo, she's acting in a completely different show right now. Oh my god, Jesus. Don't move. Oh my god, Jesus. Oh, Jackson. <laughs> First of all, I love how he's listed as Marty Bird. Not, not husband, not love, like... Not this motherfucker. <laughs> not even just Marty. Right? This is his Mexico. They're gonna come for you. Not if you do your job. Find another way to clean money. You know, I, without your help, I can't get this done as fast as I need to. Like I said, it ain't personal. Ruth is pushing it. She is. She knows that she not, he's not bullshitting. Like, Mexico will fucking waterboard you. You've done it. Again, yeah. How's your head? Depends how you mean. <laughs> what? <laughs> did you send Nelson after Rachel? You fuck yeah, I did. <laughs> <laughs> the FBI said that if Navarro died, they'd be happy to let you run the cartel. Oh my God. Are you suggesting that I run the cartel? Oh, what? Good. I'm simply saying that the FBI's already given us the answer. We don't need Navarro. <laughs> And Camilla will be head of the cartel. Yeah, Wendy, I'm not so sure the FBI is going to be willing to look the other way while Camilla has Navarro killed, and then they just they make somebody that they've never met before a, a shadow cartel leader. All they want is the money from the seizures. That Camilla's not going to get those. Mm. Why do all you women care so much about the schools? Those two are smart and shit. They're going to need good fucking teachers. And you can watch your language around me. Holy shit! Look at his face. Oh my god. Because you're not his type. Holy shit. He likes brunettes, same as me, it, and they're smart-mouthed. <laughs> Has she never lied on her father, ever? That's exactly who that guy is. Wow. <laughs> Great, let's kill these kids. Okay. Okay, as in yes? Okay, as in yes. I don't trust it. I don't trust it at all. 
I'll need to be seated on my one last time. Ugh, don't like that at all. Say that you're willing to take a financial hit if it means not getting into bed with amoral people, blah, blah, blah. Good. Potentially good is what I wanted to hear. <laughs> Ask if she's okay. Easy. Ask if she's okay. Like, <laughs> uh, good. Camilla, how are you? I'm gonna need you to tell me who killed my son. Oh. Tell him right. I'll look into it for you if you'd like, but uh, you know, I just I might not be the best person to ask. All right. Oh shit. I'll see you soon. Oh shit. She she could go around to Wendy, but Wendy's just gonna call her Rue. As she should. She we told her not to do it. Told you guys that Rue would do it. Which is just gonna pull Marty into this again for not saying Rue. What are you doing? You have roof? You have money? You already didn't get off roof, so I don't know if you call back and be like, you know what? I just lied. <laughs> 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 Maybe. Maybe. It fucks me. Hey. Your door was a little bit open. What the priest? <laughs> What's going on? So much. He's dead now. But he hit my mother. He... The way that caught her attention. Beat me and my brothers. Mm, sounds familiar, huh? Kill the man. We were joined to church. Is that right? Thanks for that. <laughs> Even the way she moves now. Holy shit. He's not joining the church. It looks like she was about to run, right? Yes. You no, know, kill him right now. Thanks, priest. Now. You're either gonna let me in this hospital, or I'm gonna leave this building, and I'm gonna kill my father. <laughs> so why don't you pass? Does Bunny have an ulterior motive for being in here? Uh, well, uh, I got an errand to run, so uh, I'll bring home dinner. Oh shit! One of your there. Yep. I don't know what's funny, but one of you's not making it to dinner. Rachel, I'm gonna eat a dinner. Did you tell the kids I'm in here? No, I did not tell the kids. I don't want to worry them. The whole point is to worry the kids. <laughs> you know we got that. If I leave here, I'll kill him. Who? What do you, what do you mean, who? My dad. <laughs> okay, that's enough. Getting all Darlene's money and coming in here with a story about cartels and Chicago and dead cops. And just what do you expect me to do here? Seriously, what is the point? The man sitting in that jail cell ain't guilty of nothing but being poor and being an asshole. And half of that ain't even his fault. Is this just to get him out before he before she dies? I guess so. Wow. Damn, she just laid all that on him. <laughs> That's impressive. I'm like, I need to stay here for a few months. Probably get our car. War with Rachel. Ooh, good call. Good call, sir. She wasn't even talking for a while. Just go. Fucking You gotta get the drop on friends, eh? I miss that first one. Oh shit! Look at Frank Jackson. Rachel killed Frank Jackson. Did not have that on my bingo card. I'm busy. I'm gonna help him his body.
Is there another season after this? No, this is it. This is the end of the show. Yes. Where have you been? Where have you been? <laughs> I have so many more questions that I don't know what they can wrap up in one episode. Like what? Everybody. <laughs> Shit about everybody. I am um, particularly Ronnie at this point. <laughs> I um that was episode uh what episode was that? Thirteen. Months. Thank you, sir. Thirteen. Appreciate it. Episode um thirteen of season four of Ozark. Uh, uh that was a lot. Um I there's so much to talk I I want to start with the end, because this might be the first complaint I've had about Ozark in a while. I'm not entirely sure I buy Rachel Kill and Frank Jackson. I don't. Yeah. I just hear. You don't. Me. First off, not only that, I don't buy that Frank Jackson just gets out of his car and calmly walks around the front of his car. <laughs> Even if he didn't see Rachel, mm-hmm. we've established Frank Jackson's rather stealthy. And just getting out of his car like whatever regular old schmo. Yeah. I don't, I don't see that. Maybe you pull up from behind. Maybe you fucking... Yeah. Like, like even ha- did he even have a gun in his hand? Yeah, he just walk thing. around like he was gonna check the hood. I would, I would have thought after the first time he got shot, he would have pulled out his gun and at least start shooting frantic, uh, you know, frantically because yeah. he's about to die. That was the thought I had, but then I would imagine that's probably been a good twenty years since Frank Jackson's been shot. Like he doesn't even remember how to react when people fight back. It's just holy shit, this is far and He's like, what is going on? <laughs> Why not, Why scramble, not behind scramble behind your car? Clearly shot, shot came from that way. That way. It was probably it was just probably fucking... fucking I forgot how to do this. Typically, we don't really talk about acting because everybody on the show is great, right? I never doubt anybody on the show, like, being who they are. It all kind of works for me. Yeah. Um, uh, special props to Winnie's actress this episode. Yo. Oh that was... That, that, I, I said that, like, midway through. I was like, this is probably her best acting performance because... It, it like after the ending of episode twelve, it was it was the big question was how is Wendy Wendy gonna react to everything that happened that constant L she was taking in the last episode and this was just superb superb on so many levels like the little talking to herself <laughs> the little comments under her breath the, her eyes are bugged out okay. almost constantly. I have a sense of humor. <laughs> <laughs> the giggle to herself yeah. all the times. <laughs> um, I don't think we've mentioned specifically an acting performance since Ben. Right, right. Since yeah. Ben's... We talked like about that. Ruth in the first episode of season uh, four. Or no, the second, this, uh, what was it? Season, uh, episode eight. When she was oh, when she kills Javi? Yeah, but that to me, that was more the character being great. Like, I thought her performance was, like, what it usually is. It's good. Um, like, Ben was, like, stand out. Like, oh, shit. This motherfucker's acting his ass off. And that's how I felt about Wendy here. Like, yeah, Wendy acted her ass off. And this complete, I don't want to say lack of fear she has now, but this complete, like, acceptance. Like, this stranger walks into her house, and she's not twitching, she's not flinching. This just, whatever's going to happen, it's going to fucking happen. It's like she's dead already, quite frankly. I um I don't want to give another acting performance, but I do want to talk about how the dad is a psychopath, and I bought it completely. It was the first time we saw it. I went, "Oh my god!" What the <laughs> that whole scene with Ruth, I was just uncomfortable. I was uncomfortable watching it. He doesn't. You're not his type. How do you know that? He likes brunettes. How do you know that? I'm not talking to my grandma. Like, hey, Gramps, you know what really gets me jazzed up? <laughs> well, that's his dad. That's Ben's dad. So maybe talk to his dad about who he likes. Or maybe there's a pattern of brunettes that he's going out with. Yeah. By the way, he also likes brunettes, even though his current girlfriend is blonde. Which... I, 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 I did note that as well. I was like, I was like so you're not happy with you, the person you're currently with? So he's know. not. He's clearly not. Because uh, he, he's trying him. to change him. Yeah. And you can tell he, he definitely punches women in the mouth, right? Yes. Yes. Yeah. And you could tell they've always been too scared to say anything. Yeah, it seems like a mouth on you. Like, just, yo. If we were alone, he'd... he'd, he'd yeah, I'd say if fucking... If they were alone, he'd punch me right in the face. Yeah. I, ugh. Oh. Like, you remind me of my daughter. <laughs> <laughs> that fucking blonde hair. They can't be trusted. All right, sir. Two million is a lot of money, but I'm gonna keep these kids. 
It did feel very spiteful. <laughs> I'm gonna keep these kids. <laughs> new car, new house. I'm gonna keep these kids, man. <laughs> he goes, yeah, but like, I know he's a piece of garbage, but he also seems to lack any fucking, like, uh, parental compass. I'm not sure what we're looking for. Where Ruth asks about the school, he's like, what the fuck is with women in the school shit? <laughs> That part threw me so off. His head, like, and she, like, tried to make the point when he when he asked about it, and he was just too bothered by her cursing, like, not getting the point of what she was trying to say. <laughs> I guess, as much as I hate him, I'd be lying to the other side. What the fuck is this? Fucking kid, the kids! Who cares? It's school! Who cares? <laughs> Only teacher you need is God. Um, oh, that might have been it. That might have been the point. That's what you need for the week. Just go to church on Sunday. Uh, that was a great episode. That's been my favorite episode in a while. Probably my favorite episode since uh, Hobby died. And to be fair, I was fucking oof. I could watch Hobby die all day. You know, I was completely shocked by it. Absolutely. That was well worth it. Well worth it. I'm going to say, I do like Wendy and Marty's play about um, mostly Wendy's. Marty went along with it because he didn't have a better uh, solution of getting rid of um, Navarro. Cause can be honest, what if we don't like the sister for whatever reason? We don't like her. I'm not sure why. Um, Navarro's been nothing but trouble. Yes. Every two episodes, he has an outrageous request that Marty and Wendy have to get done in a ridiculous amount of time. I need you to do it tomorrow, Wendy. <laughs> <laughs> Make it happen, Marty. Like what, the, nigga? We did this last episode. You need four months. I'll give you four days. <laughs> And they've always made it happen, and they've gotten no further along than when they first started. Yeah, this is true. So fuck it, let's try with somebody else. Fuck it. Javi was a bad pick because he was a psychopath. Can't do with people like that. But the sister seems reasonable. Is she though? Is she though? But what? Wendy what has to be honest with her. <laughs> when she asks that question, it's about that time. If you don't, you know, we care for Ruth, but Wendy has made it perfectly clear. She does not care for Ruth, so I don't under I don't understand why she would keep that information to herself if Camilla if Camilla asks. Oh, she won't. But you would have to. But would you have to um, get your story straight with Marty? Because Marty's already said uh, I didn't know. So do you have to say Marty wasn't there? Are we asking about Wendy being on the same page with Marty? I don't think this is a thought process or concern whatsoever. I think oh. she's going to go. It's Ruth and deal with everything else after the fact. Particularly now, yeah. Whether it hangs Marty or not. See, that's, see, that's where we disagree. I feel like um, if she can do A and save Marty, or do B and not save Marty, as long as those two choices are equal, she'd save Marty every time. Oh, no. Yeah, she would. How do you... How do you like, I'm she hates Ruth. No, that's not... What I'm saying is, if she, can, if she buries Ruth either way, she's going to make sure Marty's okay if she can help it. Now, if she can't help it, I mean, I don't know. But don't, I'm saying if she can help it, why not? I don't know if she has the thought process about Marty, period, in the first place. You mean I could hang roof right now? Yes, this. Oh, the, shit, that fucks Marty. Oh. That, see, that's the part I'm concerned about. Especially in this current state she's in. She might just say some shit under her breath, quite frankly. <laughs> What'd you say? Roof. Like if Fucking the other murderer. Person, the other person <laughs> is talking, and, and then they're like, well, Marty's hating. No. Huh. <laughs> <laughs> well,. You know how Marty is. He forgets things. I uh, can always trust Marty with these things. We kill Marty too. We probably get Ruth and Marty killed. Um. Yeah, I don't. I don't, I don't know. MVP. Wendy, <laughs> back on top. <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> Just for the acting. Cool. I'm not. I don't hate that idea. Uh, I'm right. I'm gonna give it to Ruth. Yes. Um, cause she didn't die. I had to wear up all to go to the cops. Told the cops everything. Did something nice by getting this poor bastard out of jail. Got her money in American banks. Uh, now granted she's gonna have the cartel on her ass even more now cause you killed Frank Jackson. And they knew where they sent Frank Jackson. Yeah. Um, so that's it. That's for another episode. That's for another episode to deal with. Right now, we fucking, I'm giving it to Ruth. Then I'm give it to fucking Rachel. How the fuck you made it? I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> Matt, I'm fucking, fucking, um, Frank Jackson in the dark, in the rain, pulling up with no notice, and you survived. I don't know. And how. you got a shotgun, like, which kicks back. It's usually. Oh, it's a rifle. 
All right. Apparently, she's strong enough to hold it. Apparently, what kind of rifle is that? Mm. Well, one Wendy uses. Apparently, I mean, uh, Ruth uses. Um, and bronze. Ooh. I'm sorry. That's one day for me. Uh, agreed. Because even though even though she's she's gone off, she still got the the super pack deal. She's working out with uh, her gay husband. <laughs> yeah. So Jim, <laughs> Jim is hilarious. Uh, you know what? Yeah. Because she's so, still got things to play. Yeah, it's like, wait, we could, we don't even need that guy. We could just say, fuck that guy and even be better off for it. Right. Get rid of the election thing. Um, I'm saying, I'm saying, just her not giving a fuck. That's what, that's what I'm here for. Her not giving a fuck <laughs> means she is more effective. I go silver uh, Rachel because, yeah, Frank Jackson. How do you kill Frank Jackson with a rifle and you're Rachel? You <laughs> seasons ago. Right. Uh, and then Ruth. I know about that. LVP? That'd be Frank Jackson, right? Uh, I'm going to say Marty. Oh, I'm curious about this. Let's hear this. Because Marty's the one that's going to deal with the fallout of all of this, including the death of Frank Jackson, quite frankly. Because Wendy's in a mental hospital. How does she order the hit? It's going to be fucking Marty. It's all going to fucking fall on Marty. Like, it always falls on Marty. Well, he doesn't look at anything in this. So much. And he just lied to Camilla. That part is concerning. Um, oh. I don't hate that pick. He's got to deal with Wendy in a psych ward. He's got to deal with the kids. He's got to deal with the dad. He's got to deal with Camilla. He's got to deal with the Frank Jackson fallout. He's got to deal with Roof in the casino and Rachel and not being able to wander. I think, by the way, I think Jonah doesn't buy. I think jo- Jonah knows at least part of his mom being in a hospital is a, a play. Yes. A strategy. Yeah. Uh, even though a lot of it isn't, apparently. She's like, if I get out, I'll just kill him. Who? <laughs> Who? <laughs> Yeah, what are we even talking about? <laughs> My dad. Uh, that's enough. That's enough. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I don't want to give Marty LVP just for that. That's enough. All right. All right. No more talking. I don't want to hear this. You're making me a fucking... Uh, uh, what do you call that? Yeah, an accomplice. <laughs> I'm accomplice before the fact. I'm, no more. He's like, nah, I'm good on this. Yeah, I'm going Frank Jackson. You get shot by Rachel twice. Sorry. All right, so... I got, my, my medalist would be uh, Frank Jackson, Marty... And Navarro. Damn. Because he's, he's not needed anymore. Damn. He had two people on his side. Two of the most competent people on the planet. And you keep fucking them in the ass. Why? Sorry. I can't respect it. I need to get off this list mode. <laughs> I don't want to be the LVP, Wendy. <laughs> Make it happen, Marty. <laughs> <laughs> um, plug? Check out our YouTube channel, True Hill Heat. You can see me and Jimmy every Thursday, 105 p.m. Eastern Time, AE Ramble, reviewing AEW Wednesday Night Dynamite. This week, it's on a Wednesday if Jimmy decides to put this out. Before. Not for much longer, because I'm about to jump ship. Have you seen the job Triple H has been doing? Triple W, you are you welcome. You watching it. Triple W. I read it. it. I read it. I read my PW Torch reports. <laughs> Triple W. <laughs> He it. <laughs> He's got the whole world wrestling entertainment <laughs> in his palm. Post your comments down below. Like, share, subscribe.